Chanel and I'm standing out the front of the Melbourne Exhibition Centre for the L'Oreal Paris AFI Awards. Now today is such a star-studded night, I have no idea where to begin. I mean, we've had the likes of Kate Blanchett, Daniel Radcliffe, we've had Eric Banner, Heath Ledger, the list goes on. Tonight promises to be a fantastic night, but my mission to find out what the stars were like when they were single and if they ever did anything outrageous. You never know, they might have done something more stupid than me. Celebrities, they never seem to put a foot wrong, or do they? And Heath Ledger has just kissed somebody. I asked a few Tinseltown stars about their most embarrassing moments with the opposite sex, and as these first two celebrities are comedians, you can just imagine how outrageous their stories will be. What's the most outrageous thing you've done as a single? As a single? Oh my dear lord! Um, I've no idea. Here's the dumbest thing I've done. This was when I was at university. I tried to impress a lady. There was a girl at the bottom of um, uh, elevators, escalators, and she was giving away, you know, whatever it was. And I thought, I'm going to buy her a coffee because she's been there all day. So I went and got a coffee and went down the escalator as she went up. And I went, oh. So I ran up the escalator, got to the top, tripped, fell, spilled coffee all over her feet, and then just got up and walked away and pretended that I wasn't buying coffee for her. <laughs> You really impressed her, didn't you? Oh, that's good, that's class. good. The ladies love a vulnerable man. Oh, God. What about you? Have you just done something completely embarrassing? Yeah, absolutely. Well, no one knew about it. It was just for me, but I went to a, a concert and it was quite intimate. This band was playing and I thought, oh, hang on, that, that guy's looking at me. He's, you know, I think, mean, you know, this, I, might, I might be, you know, he's sort of singing away, looking at me. I'm thinking I'm pretty special. And then he goes, in the next song, he announces it and he goes, this song's called I've Got a Lazy Eye. And I've just gone, oh. <laughs> here I am thinking I'm the hottest thing on, you know, and he wasn't even looking at me. And then there are some stories others would rather not mention. Were you ever outrageous when you were a single black? Yeah, I didn't get married till I was 29, so I had plenty of time to be stupid. Um, I think it's probably a, a, a key to um, a happy marriage too, yeah. I'm going to share one of those stupid stories with Absolutely us. not. <laughs> Absolutely not. There are plenty of people who can vouch for that, not myself. And what about young Daniel Radcliffe? Has this wizard's magic ever backfired? Now, what's the most embarrassing thing you've said or done in front of a girl you were trying to impress? I don't know. Um, what, what have I done? I mean, I, 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 I don't really... Um, I don't know. I don't know, to be honest. It's a really boring answer. I'm so smart. Exactly. This is my problem. That I'm, I'm just too smart. No, I, that's certainly not the issue. I don't know. I probably have said really stupid things or, or just gone really, really quiet and awkward. But I can't remember something specifically that I have said or done. Well, Phil, sure, speak to me in a couple of years and I'm sure I've done something by then. Well, we'll just hold you to that one.